Alrighty guys, I am heading to the gym now. I'm just getting in my car. Oh. And I'm gonna go train shoulders, tries, and a little bit of core. So I'll try to film some for you all, but if I don't, I'm sorry. Just going to tweed girls and I don't really like filming that. But if I do, then you'll get to see it. If I don't, then you'll see me soon. Are you ready? Hi, can I just get a grande iced Americano with a sugar-free caramel syrup? Yeah, sure. And just a single shot? Yes, please. No worries. You're out of you. Thank you. Thank you. Alrighty, that is the worst angle. I'm just going to hold it. So I just finished at the gym. It was probably one of the best sessions I've had since I've been back. And I am so proud of myself. Like, I pushed myself to my absolute limits. My shoulders are sore. They're so my shoulders are literally I can't even talk like shaking um, while I'm holding the camera but I have just got my favorite um, I just got a coffee from Zarafas and I'm about to head into the shop so I'm gonna go get the cheese that I was talking about from Coles and I want to have a look at a Fitbit because I was wearing my dad's but he's kindly taken it back <laughs> so yeah i want to go have a look at one of them because i really need to track my steps and stuff and my phone just doesn't do justice um so yeah i need to get that because obviously while i'm at work i walk around a lot and i need to know how many steps i'm doing just so i can calculate it because if i'm doing more then obviously i'm gonna have to up my calories and if i'm not doing enough then i need to be walking while i'm at the gym um yeah just do cardio after or before my gym session so yeah, I'm gonna have a look at that and then I really want to get the filler shoes and I know that my mum will probably flip her shit if I buy another pair of shoes because I honestly have so many um, but I just really like them they've grown on me I didn't like them at the start but now I do and I really want to get a pair so we'll see I'll go into platypus and see if they're good or not but yeah sorry mum if I do and I also need to um, going to Prouds because on my birthday when I went to Sydney my best friend Ali um, brought me um, my 20th birthday present and she was going to give me something special for my 21st but because she's gone to America I don't know if I will see her on my 21st birthday next year or if she will even be here so she decided to get me something special for my 20th um, which obviously yeah, it's just me up to my 21st. But um, what she got me was something that I can hold on to forever and that I'll be able to keep and obviously remember her as well. So um, she got me a ring and it's like nine carat or something. It is so pretty. I'm like shaking so much from gym. That's the ring. Um, and I have really chubby fingers, like oh shit I'm gonna lose it um yeah I have really chubby fingers and like stumpy like knuckles and stuff so obviously it doesn't fit and she knew that but they didn't have a larger size so I'm gonna have to go into crowds and see if I can um get it sent away so I can get it resized and it's gonna have to go up two sizes because yeah chubby fingers but yeah that's what I have to do and then I have to go home have my post-workout meal have a shake um get my meal to hopefully in or take it to work and have it during work and then um i start work at two finish at seven and then i'll have to figure out what i'm doing after that but yeah i have five more meals to eat and it is like 12 o'clock so yeah i'm running out of time but i will go into the shops hopefully maybe take you guys with me we'll see um how i feel and if there's many people in there but yeah, that's what my plan is and I'll catch up with you guys as soon as I can. session like 
in my chest and my shoulders and like my traps a little bit. I haven't done like chest press in ages and I did dumbbell chest press yesterday. And oh my am I sore. I'm just having my morning oxy shred. Um, what flavour have I got today? Pink grapefruit. This is actually the first time I tried this flavour and I actually really enjoyed it. Um, but I had the worst sleep last night. Like I couldn't get to sleep. I don't know why. Like I was trying and trying and just wouldn't get to sleep. So I really, like kept like tossing and turning and going on my phone and it was just so crap. Like I probably should have had oxy sleep, but if I can be completely honest with you, it, like it doesn't taste that bad. I just I just don't know. Like I just don't enjoy drinking it. So I just yeah whatever didn't even think twice about having it but yeah that was my sleep last night and we were sleep at like 12 31 and then i woke up at 8 30 so it's that like seven hours sleep and seven and a half hours sleep it's all right but it's not the best but yeah and yesterday i felt sick but i was at work and like i had lunch and then all of a sudden i just like felt sick like you know when you feel like you're gonna vomit and like you can feel it like you just feel off like I just oh it was so bad so I ended up leaving work early they were already gonna cut my shift back an hour anyway because it was pretty quiet so I left early and then I came home and I was like oh I don't really feel that great I missed two of my meals yesterday because I just couldn't like eat it um but so like I got home and I had a shower and then I laid in bed and I was watching Netflix and then I felt a little bit better so I decided to come out and instead of having like something heavy like my two, last two meals which was like my oats, my protein oats with like blueberries and then my dinner which was sweet potato and chicken or whatever, um, I decided to have two pieces of toast just with Vegemite on it because I just, yeah, I couldn't stand the thought of eating like oats or something. Um, and it's not really going to affect me that much because um, I'm in like maintenance phase at the moment anyway. So I'm not trying to lose body fat. So that was fine. Um, and then, yeah, when I was trying to get to sleep, I thought maybe I'm hungry because I haven't eaten much today. So I um, came out and literally poured a massive bowl of Cocoa Pops, like, that is not my plan at all, and obviously it's got sugar in it and whatever else, and I had it with full cream milk, like, I didn't even have it with almond milk, and so I had a massive bowl of Cocoa Pops, and I was like, maybe I was hungry, maybe that's why I couldn't sleep, and then I tried to get to sleep, in like, half an hour, I still couldn't sleep, so... Then I got to sleep and then I wake up this morning and I check in with my coach every morning. Well, I don't check in with him, but I weigh myself every morning so then you can see like how my body fluctuates and where it's at and what's going good with it and whatever else. But yeah, I wake up this morning and I hopped on the scales and I was 69.8 or something. And yesterday I was 70.7. So I'm like, what? Because I had two pieces of toast and I had cocoa pops and I didn't have my other meals. So all that there probably would have been similar, if not a little bit more, or maybe a little bit less calories than I'm supposed to have. But yeah, so body is weird. I can tell you that. Just a little update on last night and this morning and how I'm feeling as I said I would. But that's about it, guys. have sent us six products for helping out. Oxy sleep. 
sleep peach iced tea flavor <sighs> haven't tried this one and i'm excited to try it because as you all may know if you follow me on instagram i have the oxy sleep in the strawberry daiquiri flavor and i don't really like it being completely honest with you guys it's not really my favorite flavor i don't know why i just i just don't enjoy it um so that's that this big one i'm assuming it's going to be protein because of the big box this one either I normally have the RP Max in the citrus margarita um, and I think that's it I normally just have the PSI so excited to try that one too <laughs> know that this is literally my favorite product i have it every single morning um and passion fruit is one of my favorite flavors ever so yay oh a little alcarnitine so that is perfect for stacking with your oxygen of the morning so if you don't know what alcarnitine is it the pepper is it is basically um an amino acid and it helps with freeing like fatty acids and it also helps with muscle recovery so that is perfect for stacking with your oxy shred and last but not least in the flavor rainbow candy this is by far probably coming in second now my favorite flavor of oxy shred passion fruit was probably my best my um, favorite flavor and then they brought in the rainbow candy and now they've got the hardcore grape bubble gum which is now my favorite but this definitely comes close to being first so these are the products I received from EHP labs basically I've got everything I've got my oxygen which I have in the morning which I stack with my L-carnitine and then I have my RP max which I have before I work out as a pre-work pre-workout and then I'll have my aminos during training which is in the kitchen and then I'll have my chocolate peanut butter iso pet after training and then I'll have my oxy sleep before bed so that's literally my daily products right here so for those of you that were wondering what I take during the day or what supplements I have this is literally it um I also have L-glutamine in five grams of it in my protein as well um which isn't here either but that's that i am gonna go have a shower wash my hair get myself a little bit looking better that didn't even make sense but you get what i mean head to the shops get some liquid gold bondi sands and then come home have lunch and then get ready for rego Alrighty guys, I am now about to get ready. Um, I've got all my makeup set out. Currently don't have many clothes on, so I am <laughs> not going to show you guys. I'm sitting in front of the mirror if that helps. Alright, so my makeup is finished. I've got my tan on. Not that you can tell. Just got them on for my dress tonight. My hair is not done yet, as you can see. Um I'm waiting for it to dry. It's still a, bit, a little bit damp up here. And if I blow dry it, then it's going to go poofy. So yeah, I need to do that, straighten it, and then I'm going to put my extensions in. That's the end result. <laughs> Getting excited. I am wearing just a black cook eye dress and my new black heels that I brought yesterday. I will show you guys later. Third meal going down. 
Hey guys, so I thought I'd just quickly jump on. I've just left home. I'm heading up to Broad Beach now to Crystals. Um, and then we're gonna head to Reggio, obviously. I am just wearing a boob tube at the moment and some pants. Um, just something really comfortable because I've still got the gold tan on and it's supposed to be like, sorry, <laughs> it's supposed to dry straight away, but I still feel a little bit sticky. I think I'm just sweating a bit um, from getting ready. But yeah, I'm wearing Crystal's um, black hook eye dress and my shoes are just down there. If you can see them, um, I'm trying to get onto the highway, this is a bit of a mesh. Don't want the cars to see me holding my phone because I'd be a bit, you know. I'm just going to hold it down here for a sec. That is the worst camera angle possible, but you know, <laughs> that's so fine. Also, I have some really exciting news. Um, for most of you that have been following me for a while, um, you would know that I am with EHP Labs and I am also with Fit Cover. Um, and a short time ago, I was also with Rideaway, but due to um, my content, well, it wasn't really my content actually, it was just the fact that not many people were using my code. Um, they ended the partnership, which was like, it kind of sucked a bit because you know, not everyone's going to buy stuff every month. Um, but, like, I still purchase right away to this day. And I actually just got an email from them. I'm going to put the phone down again. Hey, guys. <laughs> it's the best ends ever. Lucky my makeup and my hair's done, so it makes me look half decent at a shit angle. Um... Hurry up. Don't look at me, P planer. Yeah, I'm just gonna continue my story anyway. They ended the partnership and this is really bad. I really need one of those things that like holds my phone. Ah! Um, yeah, they ended the partnership. I think I've said that about three times now. But I just got an email from the social media influencer and marketing manager from Right Aware and they want to partner again. So that is some really exciting news for my Friday. I obviously just got my massive delivery from EHP and now I've got an amazing email from Right Aware. So I think you could say my weekend has started off pretty great. I feel like there's so many people looking at me going, what is she doing with her phone? Um, and like, why is she talking to herself? Because I'm underneath like a tunnel thing and there's like heaps of cars. But yeah, I just wanted to quickly jump on and say that because that was really exciting and I didn't want to hold it in any longer. But yeah, heading to the Red Zone now. I will film while I'm there, show you guys what it's all about. Obviously, you'll see it in October as well. But yeah, just a little behind the scenes stuff for now. For the Gold Coast show. I can't. That just sounded like I'm watching the Gold Coast show. Um, yeah, I'm really excited for tomorrow I can't wait to see everyone and I know so many people competing so I'm so excited to see how they look they already look freaking amazing and tomorrow they're just gonna shine on the stage so um, yeah I'm so excited I will chat to you guys when I get changed show you all what I'm wearing and then yeah show you guys when I'm at Rachel. I feel like there's gonna be heaps of traffic but whatever I left early so I had to get to Crystal Good morning guys, happy Saturday. So I'm just heading um, to pick up Taya now. Um, <clears throat> she arrives at 9.20 and it's just 10 past nine. So hopefully I'll get there when she's about to walk out. We had an amazing time at Rejo last night. I didn't film anything um, just cause I was like so many people and I didn't want it to seem like I was competing. So I didn't film anything, but I might be able to get some content off some of the other girls if they filmed, hopefully. I'll see, but yeah, I'm just heading to the airport now. I'll try and clean this up because I've still got my shoes in here. This is what I wore. I wore these wedges and a black cook eye dress. I don't even think I showed you. See, this is, what I, this is what I mean. Like, I get so sidetracked and I just don't even, like, film anything. I don't know if that's how they're supposed to go in the box, but whatever. Yeah, I get so sidetracked all the time. And I'm like, oh yeah, like I'll film this, I'll do that, I'll do this. And then 
I don't even do it. So whatever, Yasmin. Hopefully I'll film stuff today. I'm gonna go pick up Taya and then we're quickly coming back to mine. And she needs to put her food in the fridge because obviously she's prepping as well. And then we're gonna go to the show. So the show starts at 10. Um, and then, yeah, so that's the plan for today. Super excited, halfway, like when the show, when the first show finishes, the morning show, we're gonna go train, legs, and then get ready for the night show, and then go to the night show, and then we've got our dinner with our coach. She just texted me, she's landing, so I better go. Please. Perfect, hold the line, please, gentlemen. Just make sure the judges can see your numbers, please. So if you want the first place, make sure they can see your numbers. Special thanks to Dallas Olsen Studios. Dallas Olsen is the official W. Competitor 179. 180, step forward, please. Competitor 182. Competitor 189, step forward please. Competitor 190.